Israel Folau. He's had his fair share of dramas over the past fortnight. He's had another interrupted preparation here. Uh, Stephen Larkham said this week that he's expecting Izzy will light up the final series. Let's hope so. Well, Izzy new surrounds here at the Lensbury. How's it going for you? Yeah, pretty good, you know. Um, I think uh, the guys are really enjoying it ever since we got here. And it's uh, great surroundings, I think. Um, and everything's uh, pretty central, you know. I think the, the footy fields are uh, um, just behind the, the hotel, and uh, you know, which uh, saves time for the boys. But, uh, yeah, the guys are definitely enjoying it here. You hear the guys talk about the tournament starting again now. Like, you, you reach the knockout stages and it's, it's uh, sudden death. How does that change things for you? Look, I think for the group, it uh, wouldn't change too much, you know. I think uh, the, the mentality has been uh, pretty much like that from uh, from the start of the, the competition, and um, you know now it, it, there's no other, there's no other option really. It's it's uh, like you say, it's, um, it's knockout footy now, and it's got to take one game at a time. And Scotland um, is it, going to be a tough game for us, so we got to make sure we have a good week of uh, of training and make sure we uh, we turn up and, and ready to play. Talking about a good week of training, I don't know how much you're getting to do with that with that foot, that ankle. How bad is it, and how's it affecting your game? Yeah, look, it's uh, yeah, it's it's uh, it's not too bad. It's one of those injuries where you could uh, uh, actually play through a game, but um, I guess it just limits my um, opportunity to to, uh, to get some training done during the week. But you know, that's part of footy. You know, you get um, yeah, injuries that come with it. You just got to cope with it as best as you can and, and, um, and, and do the best that you can with uh, in terms of physio and, and looking after and making sure that you can uh, get um, get yourself right for the game. And just finally, um, how much belief did that period of being down to 13 men and, and holding Wales out, what did that do for this side? Yeah, look, it, it was, uh, you know, looking back at the game now, it, it, was a, it was a tremendous effort from the guys. and. You know, especially in that, in that time of the game with, um, with 13 men down, it was, uh, I guess the, the team showed some great spirit to, to really hold out and, and, um, and defend our line, you know, for a long period of time there. And, you know, going into the game, you know, we, we um, as a team, we talk about belief and that, but I, I think, you know, coming out of that, being tested in that area really sort of uh, gave us uh, that extra bit of confidence. But, um, yeah, you know, we can draw on that, but making sure that we stay humble and, and keep working hard throughout the, this whole week because again, like I say, Scotland's going to be a tough game. Yeah, tough game, but you've grabbed the attention of a whole country, so go well on Saturday. Thanks, mate. Cheers.